Hey, orange one here. We're by our second castle here, and we uh, we really need to basically just get stronger and recruit some of these prisoners um, and recruit lords. That's that's my real thing right now, is that we need to have some sort of lord. Um, a vote for peace with Vlandia. Yeah, I don't know if I want peace with you guys. I think I'm, I'm going to take more cities from you guys, if anything. Um, but I need to find, like, a Vlandian lord or two to join up with me. So I think we'll just get some troops. Um... And maybe drop off some people at this castle, just so, like, it has some defense, you know? Uh, let's see... Vlandia wants to make peace with me, basically. That's not happening. I'm gonna get more cities, dude. Like, come on. Seriously. Okay, there's 20 mountain bandits there. That is tempting to at least build up the relationship with the local lords. And then I'll be able to, you know... Oh my gosh, look at all these people who need upgrades. That's crazy. Why do they all need upgrades? They must have been... I thought I upgraded them at the end of last episode, but it looks like I didn't. Yeah, we've got a lot of our companions now, which is fantastic. It's really nice to play with that. Um, yeah, I think we just need to get in there, fight some people, get a little bit stronger after we've uh, got our troops and this castle up, and maybe try and find a lord to recruit or not. Um, was, yeah, I was going here. Recruit troops, sure. Oh, nice. That was, that's a good amount. Um, also, you know what we can do that we should have done a long time ago? Is I should, uh, let's see. I think I need to go to a party and then talk to one of my companions and give them some troops. Lossless, guess what? You're going to be a general. Our first general. Your highness. <laughs> um... No, hold on. Oh, okay, never mind. I'm, I'm doing this the wrong way. Like I said, it's, uh, or did I say it? It's been a while since I played this game. If I go to L for clan, can I create a party? I can. Nice. Okay, so let's go with Lossless, because he's got some health. And then I'm going to give you, like, a ton of troops. Like, good troops, too. So please don't kill them all. Um, I'll hold on to the ones that need leveling up mostly and just give you like super troops. I just need to make sure that you've got enough troops to follow me and then we should be good. I think that that's more than enough. So then I can then go to lossless and I can say, hey, join, uh, join me. Why don't you? Not enough influence? Oh no. Am I going to generate influence now? I think, oh man, I'm in the negative influence. I'm not sure how to get out of that. Uh, I didn't realize that he was not going to actually join and follow me. This is a problem. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do about this influence thing. Does he generate influence for me if I look at my clan, at least? It doesn't look like he's uh, generating influence for me, which is super weird. I would have thought that he uh, he would have. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I think I'm just gonna have to tell this guy to um, give me all the troops back. We're gonna have to. I don't know. Just disband you. And try and find some lords. <laughs> I I don't know. Can we even change our laws? You want to resolve? Okay, yeah. Sure. Um, oh, does that help me generate more now? No? It gave me some more influence, maybe. Not really sure what's going on. Oh, you know what we can do? Hold on. Let's go to clan. Let's go to Oslis. I'm going to disband this party. He should join back up with me. And then we can actually, you know what we can do is we can go to our castle and donate a ton of prisoners, get in the positive influence-wise, and then we should be okay. I think I'm going to go to Epicrotia, though. 
Why is he still wandering around? Uh, whatever, Lossless, you can go bumble around in the brambles if you like. I just want to make sure that our castles that we do get we can actually hold, because I am anticipating that we'll get attacked. Um, somewhat soon, I don't know exactly when. Okay, Tavern, definitely want to recruit you all. And the prisoners, um, I'll hold on to them still. It looks like this has all been cleared out, probably by me, pretty recently as well. I want to go over here, because I might be able to be at this hideout during night. Yeah, let's just, let's just clear this out a little bit. It's going to be pretty soon. Like, we're not going to have to wait that, that long. Yeah, cool. Yeah, let's, uh, let's do a little good deed. We'll ingratiate ourselves to the, uh, the locals here. I mean, there's only 20 of them, right? I think. And this is Mountain Bandits, so it is uh, concerning with the Javelins. But we'll, we'll be able to get them. Come on, there we go. Got a hit. This person's gonna go down. Okay. Looks good. Um, we are kind of hurting. Definitely lost more than I, I would like. But myself, I'm at full health, so I think that we're okay. I mean, honestly, we just need to get to the bandit leader. We just killed like four of them or something. I don't know. I like want to do commentary, but I'm also like really nervous. <laughs> there we go. That guy didn't last too long. I mean, I know that with my gear, I should be able to kill mountain bandits pretty easily, so I'm not too concerned. It's more about the javelins, more than anything else. It's those dang javelins. Like that guy, he almost got me. Oh, there goes one of my highwaymen. Oh. Um, stop throwing those javelins, please. There we go. Okay, look, we're we're holding our ground. You know, I think we're we've got a oh, chamber blocked. Did I didn't do that? He must have chamber blocked, right? Can I? Yes, I can. Any other highwaymen? Not that I'm seeing. But I'll get the shield out just in case. Yeah, I uh, I am hoping that we can get a kingdom from this character, but I don't know if we will be able to. Can I hit him, please, before he starts throwing javelins at us? I'm just not sure if I'm firing. I think I'm firing too far. Yeah, there we go. Oh man. Oh, he just killed someone. You dang brigand, you. Yeah, get me with the javelin. There we go. Don't throw things at my guys. There we go. Okay, we are surviving. Definitely surviving. And there are 20 of them, right? Isn't that what we saw at the beginning? That's a good amount of them. Is that a dude that's like kneeling right there? Guys, can I just have you stand over there so you're not getting in my way, please? Are you sure that's a dude that's like right there? Yeah. Really? Why am I not hitting him? The hillman. There we go, the brigand too. Okay, those two are down. I think that's all for this little camp. Why don't I tell my guys to come up a little bit? I might as well hit them with arrows if I can, right? Yeah, there's no one else here. <laughs> that was the chief. That was a chief, not the chief. Why don't you guys follow me? I think there's one more. No, there's two, like at least two more there. If I tell you all to come here, I'm just gonna do a little Robin Hooding. And I am a little bit concerned. Yeah, that javelin could have taken me out. Can you guys throw at me, please? Not my friends. Yeah, I can I can dodge you a little bit easier than the AI can. 
though. Keep on keep on tossing this. I'm fine with that. Yep, guys, come on in. There we go, okay. We got all the raiders. That's nice. All the highwaymen. Now I'll be able to fight the leader. This is my kingdom, dude. <laughs> this is actually my kingdom. You're in my house. Very well. Oh, that was like no damage. <laughs> oh man, a little head. Uh, sword to the head there. Man, I can't wait to the mods when they kind of expand upon that a little bit more with like um i know it sounds messed up but like with like decapitation and stuff i saw that there was one but it looked a little bit uh, gimmicky to me personally i didn't really like it a whole lot i'm sure we'll take everything from there yay they like me more um will you give me some recruits then probably not but yeah actually you will cool that was definitely worth it then I mean, we only got two troops, so I don't know if it was worth it, worth it, but it's better than nothing. Can I catch those dudes? 1.4... 1.9? Really? Okay, well, we'll definitely fight these guys. I think we'll be able to get into the positive law of our prisoners, and then um, I'll be able to get some companions to follow along. At least one companion to follow along to kind of counter some of those policies that I poorly picked. Um, can I actually just... I'm just going to take a second and look at my policies. Um, I need a hundred to uh, change these. Well, that's dumb. <laughs> Can I? And yeah, this is going to be interesting. I might need like a mod or something. I can't leave the kingdom because it's mine. <laughs> oh, the Northern Empire apparently has a thousand people. Um, I'm not going to propose that, no. We don't really have the influence. Um, can I catch this group? I can, yeah. <laughs> you guys really? I thought you were going to join me, but okay. We'll, we'll wipe the floor up a little bit here. Follow your sergeants! Honestly, I'm kind of just shocked that, uh... It's been so peaceful. I thought the Vlandians would have been pushing up more, but I think they're just getting crushed. Like, seriously crushed. Um, you know? And how does the Northern Empire have a thousand people? That is also something that I don't understand. I mean, they have, like, groups of, like, four or five people, honestly. Like, four or five, not, like, thousands. Man, our horses turned the group around. And the archers, too. They are also getting arched pretty bad. Man, brutal. Well, it's kind of nice when you've got that many cav then. That was like very safe way of getting rid of all of them. I don't know if I let them get away. I don't get them as prisoners, do I? That wouldn't make sense, so it's probably not the case. It'd be nice to be able to be like, hey, I'm going to capture you. I mean, we could knock them out. I could actually do that with the ones that are fleeing is try and knock them out a little bit. That could actually be an interesting strategy. Try and build an army just by knocking out people. Sure, we'll take them all. Just because we get a good amount of influence for it. Um, yeah. A few upgrades. I mean, don't get me wrong, I would like as many of those prisoners to be my soldiers as much as possible, but if we're in the negative in our influence, I don't I don't know how we're going to change it otherwise. Um, so let's manage the... Go to the dungeon, manage prisoners, and we're going to put in some prisoners. Uh, let's see. The ones that I can't recruit, you can have, basically. And we'll see where that gets us. You can also take the looters. I don't want level 1 looters. I mean, I'm not sure if I even want that Sturgeon or Batanian. I'll keep them, though. I'll keep them. Where does that get me in terms of influence? Did that not change my influence at all? That 
I thought that that changed influence. I, or did it only do a small amount? I feel like, what if I go to manage garrison and give troops here? Will that give me some influence at the least? If I do something like that. I'm just curious. It does not look like that changes my influence. Okay. Um, well, we're going to have to go on the offensive. It looks like if we want to have a balanced influence, we're going to have to, I don't know, win a lot of fights, I guess. How many defenders do you have? That's 136 defenders. Oh my gosh, another 130-something. There's a lot of defenders there. Um, I think we just kind of need to get into the thick of the Vlandian territory, and I hate to say it, but do, like, basically... Just really aggressive things. Are you gonna um, grow at all, Karanog? I go to like my clan fiefs. Uh, Karanog, can I assign Glossless there? Yes, and so that is increasing now, I think. Uh, that's got like 50 something in the militia. You know what? I'm gonna put another person on there. Seeing how they're kind of not really doing much with it with me. Let's just get into Vlandian territory and yeah, we'll like raid some villages or something. I don't think that they're sending any armies back towards us. Has failed with equal support on both sides. Like, how do I do this peace thing? I don't I don't think we want to, but yeah. Hold on, give me a second. Okay, so um, it's actually the next day since when I was recording, I had to like stop. Um, but basically I have looked at some nobles that don't like, um, like this guy right here, he doesn't like his, his king, Dart Heart. So I went through here and kind of looked at all of the people. There's like Khalid, um, Belgir, I think, and Ekarand. And they're all kind of up in here, so I'm going to try and make my way towards them and hopefully get to re uh, recruit them. I'm okay with also attacking villagers along the way. I'm totally okay with attacking um, like caravans and villagers because we really, really, really need the um, combat experience. Uh, just to get our, our stats up a little bit more. Um, we're pretty slow right now. Why are we so slow? These guys all seem really fast in comparison to me. Um... Maybe I should be looking at raiding some places. That's got a lot of defenders. I don't want to raid that. Yeah. No, this is not where we want to fight. We want to make our way to up there. Whatever's the quickest way. Um, sure, we'll go by here and we'll see if we can get some recruits. Nope. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Do you guys have those quests? Family Feud? No. That's not that's not gonna happen, I'm sorry. Maranath, I might be able to get some recruits there though. It's sort of oh, what what is this? Are you going to besiege my my things? I think they might be going to try and besiege my castle. Cause like where would they be taking an army of four hundred, right? Um if they are. Yeah, let's definitely get those guys. If they are going to our settlement, we need to defend it. I mean, I'm pretty sure that's what's happening. Oh, that like kind of jumped around a little weird there. If I talk to you, can I travel, convince you to join us? And you're not in our enemy faction. Um, quick question, nope. Oh, uh, oh wait, no, hold on. Something I'd like to discuss. Um, I'm not seeing an option to get him to join me. Why? I'm I'm confused. Like how to how do you get people to join? Is it just because we're not like at war with them, possibly? Because if we go to um, the kingdoms, which we should show up on here too, right? Yes, we do. 
So if we look, we're actually at war with the Northern Empire. Maybe you're just not one of the, um, if we look at the Northern Empire, maybe you're not an actual lord. Is probably what's happening. Who's this guy that we're talking to? Garios? Um, Garios, here we go. The Comos. Actually, no, you are part of, that's so weird. Very strange that you will not join me. Well, I mean, you do have a hundred people. I think I should probably attack him just to get uh, some combat in. If I deliver my demands, is that what I need to do to get him to join? I think that might be what I need to do to get him to join. Before we attack him, though, it's just... Let's just level up a little bit. The army of 400 is is really, really concerning for me. I mean, they might just be going to attack like an Asari captured thing, and we're totally fine. But I don't know. Um, yeah, it doesn't seem like there's any option for us... Um, yeah, I don't think that this guy is going to join us, so, yeah, you're going to die. Oh, wait, what? Oh, this is Western Empire. Okay. <laughs> Strange. Um, the Western Empire, they don't have land, do they? Oh, there's... Doy, that guy wasn't even hostile to me. Sergeants, take command. I think I'm just gonna attack. That was maybe completely unnecessary for me to attack this guy. Kind of feel bad now. We're just like warmongering against like the empire, I and mean, we did say that we want to make the empire fall, so <laughs> we're just guaranteeing that, I suppose, right? Um, actually, guys, can we just all hold here just for a little bit? Just hold on. Let's get the infantry, uh, like there. Everyone. Why are my horses, like, they seem to be continuing to charge in there. I don't know why. So let's see. Infantry, you can kind of go near the bottom there. Archers up here. Yeah, we'll just kind of hold on the hill and shoot them. Now it tends to work pretty well, and we'll get the cavalry to flank him a little bit. Um, let's see, infantry. Actually, infantry, can I just have you fall back just a little bit further? Thank you. Okay, cavalry. Nice. Um. Yeah, get in there, guys. Just rush in. Oh man, we are losing more of the people than I would like. Oop. Yeah, this is, uh, I mean, we did okay. We did lose a number of people, though. You're moving so slow. Am I just, is it just me or was I moving slower there than normal? Um, hopefully we get in the net positive from that. I'm not sure if we will. That may have cost us more lives than we got, basically. And made an enemy of Garios. Just a shame. <laughs> Are you mine? I think you're mine, right? Yeah, you're mine. Actually, we only lost five people. Yeah, that was worth it. Uh, you're free to go, Garios. I, I suppose maybe you can't take people from other factions. I don't really know, to be honest. Um, but I suppose you might not be able to take them from factions that you're at peace with. But that doesn't really make sense. You know, like, just because we're at peace doesn't mean we're on the same side. I think everyone in this, in this world understands that. If you're at peace, it's just a temporary peace. <clears throat> and that there's no loyalty between the different factions. I mean, 
maybe down the road there will be because there's like the empire factions versus everyone else but as of right now that's not the case yeah we need to just build up our cavalry department i think because we're gonna want to fight them out in the open for quite a while i don't think we're gonna be um doing much else let's just keep on going oh look uh fired who are you um i'm just curious are you in charge? You're not in charge of Fen... No, that's Luican. I'm not going to be able to capture you, am I? If I can, I would like to. It, it will help with our influence drastically. 4.8. Yeah, we actually could capture him. I think I'm going to go for it. It's kind of on our way to our castles as well. Yeah, we'll actually help out with this. Oh my god, we've got like three plus times their numbers. Yeah, our influence actually um, should be just fine. If if uh, we're at negative 13 right now, if we just keep on attacking people, we'll be able to get into the positive in no time. I'm pretty confident. We just need to like basically keep on doing multiple battles at once and get ourselves in that positive so that we can then give people to our companions and then have our companions follow us. That's the, the strategy that we're having to deploy because of influence. I'm just double checking. Yeah, you guys are following sergeants. Yeah. Okay, cool. Did I not tell him? I told him to charge beforehand, didn't I? That was probably a dumb order. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Uh, maybe I shouldn't be so... Uh... I'm kind of like in the thick of it. I need to just like focus. Apologies. There we go. Are you one of mine? No, you're not. I like that. I like having to be able to tell, like, is this dude one of my soldiers or not? Oh, look, now it's extra confusing because there's other, there's the Asari yellow with my blue. You're of Landian though, right? And you're red. Yeah. It's nice when they got the shields, because then you, you have that certainty where you're like, okay, it's not just that they're wearing, like, yellow, you know? Oh, man. My garbage disposal hasn't been working for, like, the last few days. I just moved in, and actually it didn't work as soon as we moved in. We turned it on, and it, like, gave, like, its death sound. I think the place hadn't been used that we're in for, like, a while. Like, there, people hadn't been living in it for a while. Um, okay, so let's see. We'll take a few more good prisoners that we can get recruits from. Anyone ready to upgrade? Not really. Okay. I don't really know what to do with all this loot. Because we don't really have a city or any real ways of selling stuff. Um, oh, look, look. This is one of the guys that I've been looking for. Oh, can I capture you? Herrick in between us. If I can get this guy to join me, then we're going to be in a nice situation here. Um, 120. Can I actually attack Peric? Yeah, let's attack Peric. And we can attack... Um, oh, really? We're going to have to fight you? Fight you? This could be really bad for us. That's a big army against our army size, and I had really hoped After me! that we would, um, I don't know, that we'd be able to attack that Peric dude without the other guy being involved. They need to make that a little bit more clear, having those like lines of engagement or something a little bit clearer. Let's just hold this hill. I think if we hold the hill, we'll actually be in pretty good shape. Keep the infantry like here. Are they gonna come to me? They should be coming to me because they did actually want to engage in this fight, right? And they are slowly approaching. Yeah, so I think that they will engage us. Um, 
Infantry! Bowman! Let's just kind of see where we at right now. I kind of would like us a little bit further over. Arrows! Let's go like maybe here. Boom! And then the infantry. Oh, hold on. Face direction is face, face enemy. enemy. You guys can be like there, I think. That'd probably be pretty good. You're giving us some good distance. I know that we're kind of like. That's not really the best right in the center, but we've got like both peaks. That's okay with me, you know. Uh, yeah, let's get our archers and whatnot with this. It's 26, 25, 100. I think we want to just basically watch our flanks. Um, let's see, maybe we get the cavalry in um, behind them. Yeah, I think that we want to hammer sickle these guys. We'll wait for them to engage our infantry and then we'll get in there. Let's charge in. Okay, yeah, let's, let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh god, please don't shoot me. Yeah, everybody just get in there, basically. I think that we got it because we have the height advantage. Oh my god, please. Oh my gosh, no. My horse. I think that we're okay. We're actually crushing them pretty uh, definitively. Okay, yeah, we're fine. Oh. Oh man, they're starting to shoot at me. Everybody get in there. Stop letting them shoot at us. Oh my gosh. I can't hit him. There we go. Well, that went well. That went very, very well. Oh my gosh. Like, look at the ratio. Like, we crushed them. I really wish that one guy, though, we had had a chance to talk to him. The 100 stack there. Because we could have possibly recruited him. And I totally borked it in the in the meta on the strategizing there. But at least we'll get some good amount of influence for this, right? We should, at least. Um, yeah, sure. Yeah, look at that. We're in the positive influence now. <laughs> yeah, we did. <laughs> Um, yeah, I definitely want to be friends with you, so you can go. And 13 troops? Man, I don't think we even lost 13 troops, right? That was a pretty solid battle. My one issue now is that I'm going to have a ton of prisoners from that. I might not want to be carrying all those prisoners because they're going to slow me down. Yeah, I'm not sure. We'll definitely upgrade these guys, and, and we'll figure out what, what we're going to do. I think that 400 stack is this group, and so I think our castles are safe. So I think we probably just want to harass and try and recruit enemy uh, people into our faction. If the game lets me. I don't know. I'm kind of like on the beta, so I don't know if that's changed it so that I can't recruit people for some reason. I'm just not seeing the dialogue option. I'll, I'll look it up. I'll probably look it up and figure it out before you guys see it, but who knows? We'll see. We're getting near that half an hour mark, aren't we? Man. Um, <laughs> I mean, I know those other guys are kind of up there, so I think that we might want to now fall back up there. I don't know. I really have no idea what I'm doing at this point. <laughs> Uh, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.